Road to GH will reveal the story of Sasha's kidnapping by Sidwell, an unexpected and painful event that leaves Robert and Holly in shock, deeply worried for their daughter's safety. While Robert searches for clues to rescue Sasha, Holly is torn between fear and a growing sense of guilt. She had once stolen Sidwell's diamonds without considering the consequences, but now she must face the heartbreaking reality that her reckless actions have placed her daughter in grave danger. Watching Sasha suffer because of her own mistake, Holly feels the weight of suppressed regret, keeping her awake every night. Meanwhile, Robert remains unaware that Holly's actions are the cause of this ordeal, adding to his distress as he struggles to understand why his daughter is caught in such a terrible situation. In a dark and cold holding room, Sasha feels fear creeping over her. She doesn't understand why she has been kidnapped and is unaware that the root cause lies with her mother, Holly, who stole Sidwell's precious diamonds. Feeling betrayed, Sasha tells herself that she doesn't need Holly's help to escape this perilous situation. With a strong spirit and determination to rescue herself, Sasha begins to devise a bold plan. She realizes that while Sidwell is vigilant, he likely wouldn't expect a girl like her to fight back. With this in mind, Sasha decides to take advantage of any moment when Sidwell is off guard, luring him deeper into the dense forest nearby. She knows the challenging terrain could help her hide or even cause Sidwell to lose track of her. Her plan becomes clear, she will use every trick possible to draw Sidwell away from the holding area and escape before he realizes something is amiss. Though afraid, Sasha understands that this is her only chance to escape the nightmare. She silently vows to be brave, as there's no one else to save her at this moment. In her loneliness and anxiety, she becomes more determined than ever, not just for herself, but to prove that she's not a helpless victim in Sidwell's hands. Sasha is resolved to carry out her escape plan, but her recklessness soon becomes the biggest mistake of her life. In the thick darkness of the forest, she walks carefully, trying to lure Sidwell further in, hoping the dense terrain would make him lose track. However, she underestimated Sidwell, a cunning and experienced man, always alert to his prey's every move. Sidwell quickly notices Sasha's change in attitude and senses that she's plotting an escape. He watches her closely, waiting for the right moment to act. Just as Sasha believes she's close to freedom, she hears footsteps nearby. Her heart races, a sense of fear spreading as she realizes she's been discovered. In that fateful moment, Sasha finds herself ruthlessly pursued by Sidwell, with nowhere left to run. She tries to move faster, her feet crunching on dry leaves, but the gap between them narrows. In an instant, a gunshot rings out in the silent forest. Sasha stumbles, feeling a sharp pain in her chest, her body freezing in place. She collapses, her eyes wide open in helplessness as she realizes her plan has failed completely. Sidwell stands over her, looking down with cold eyes. In her final moments, Sasha understands that sometimes courage can turn into recklessness and that challenging a ruthless man like Sidwell was a price too high to pay. The forest falls silent once more, with only Sasha's motionless body left behind, marking a tragic end to her attempt at freedom. Sasha's death is a heartbreaking tragedy, a cruel end for a young girl who had done nothing wrong. She endured too much suffering and pain before losing her life in a sudden, merciless way. Fate gave her no chance to escape, to live the life she longed for. Perhaps even more tragically, Sasha carried within her the beginnings of new life, an innocent child she hadn't yet realized she was carrying. Each drop of Sasha's blood spilled not only marked the end of her life, but also extinguished a new life not yet born, turning this tragedy into an immeasurable loss. When Holly receives the news of her daughter's death, she is utterly devastated. Regret surges like waves, weighing heavily on her heart. Holly realizes that she had inadvertently led Sasha into this deadly trap with her foolish actions, stealing Sidwell's diamonds without considering the consequences. Holly understands that it was her greed and recklessness that forced her daughter to pay with her life. The image of Sasha lying in the cold, silent forest, lifeless, appears in Holly's mind like a deep, unhealing wound. She continues to torment herself, blaming herself that she should have been the one punished, not Sasha. She believes she should have faced Sidwell's merciless revenge herself. Through sleepless nights, Holly is haunted by memories of Sasha. She recalls the days when her daughter was always joyful and full of hope, unaware of the cruel fate awaiting her. Every laugh, every glance of Sasha now feels like a painful memory, 
each recollection piercing Holly's heart like a thousand blades. This loss is a deep wound, a sentence that Holly must bear for the rest of her life. She realizes that her greed caused a pain that nothing can ever heal. Holly lives with this self-imposed punishment, a suffering that perhaps no amount of time can ease. Now, Holly is left only with regret. But no matter how much she repents, she cannot bring Sasha back. The loss is too immense, beyond any remedy, so profound that she must live with the haunting knowledge that she indirectly caused her daughter's death. Holly must now dwell in the shadow of guilt, a darkness that will forever cloak her life, reminding her that a moment of foolishness can take away everything that truly matters. The price of greed and thoughtlessness was Sasha's painful death, a price Holly must pay for the rest of her life, surrounded by loneliness and remorse. Thank you.